Some families on the Hamilton Mountains say they will have nowhere to live once their rental townhomes are sold. While the owner has decided to legally sell the units on the open market, the people who live there say it's still not fair. Sean Cowan has more. Just please don't do this. It's devastating to us. The people living here say they don't want to leave, even though their townhome they're currently renting is for sale. The whole complex is in an uproar. It's not fair. We've paid our rent on time. We've been diligent in keeping our place up. This isn't right. Please don't do it. Desenzo Management owns the three townhouse complexes on the Hamilton Mountain, consisting of 123 rental units. The people living there were given notice. Desenzo plans to sell them all. Marnie Orham has lived in one of the townhomes since 2009. She currently pays $1,050 a month for rent. I, I love living here. My kids grew up here. Here we go. A bumpy ride all the way, I think. I think it's going to be really rough. I don't think it's going to be easy. Desenzo Management told CHCH News the homes were built in the 80s and were originally intended to be owner-occupied. But due to market conditions at that time, they were put up for rent instead. Desenzo now says the time has come to sell the units. With the lack of demand for new home product, there has been an even greater shortage of affordable homes. So the decision was made to sell these townhouses. Desenzo says only a few townhomes will be sold at a time. The ones currently on the market are listed in the mid to upper 500,000s. Acorn, a tenant advocacy group, says this is unacceptable. We can't afford to lose any more affordable housing. I said a couple weeks ago at the city councilor, we're looking at losing 30 to 40,000 more people to homelessness. Can we afford to do this? No. Each tenant will be offered a minimum of 60 days notice to vacate and will be provided the equivalent of one month's rent to assist in expenses related to obtaining new accommodations. But these tenants say that's not enough. Where are you going to go? I don't know. Maybe I'll go and join the tent down there. <laughs> Marnie says living in a tent may be the only option for some of the renters. Sean Cowan, CHCH News, Hamilton.